Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and today's video I'm going to show you everything you can do in order to reduce your input delay here in Fortnite on controller. If you guys enjoy this content, don't forget to leave a like ever at any further ado's. Let's get straight into this topic. And yeah guys, what I want you to do now in the first place is click on the first link in the description where you can find my website and here on the top it already says FPS boost input delay switch resolution or extras and we're going to click onto input delay and once we get redirected there should be a bunch of posts here guys and the one on the top should have exactly the same name and the same thumbnail as the video you're watching right now. Click onto that one and then once you get redirected there should be a download button which is going to redirect you from where you can download the following pack which is going to be called controller low delay pack in which we're going to have two major registry tweaks guys and timer side resolution which is still the best tool by the way right now for less delay and you can already see here now input responsiveness and short delay bouncing time and what we're going to do is apply both of these here to our registry so just simply click onto it so just simply click onto it and then click onto yes add both of them and you should instantly feel that any device you plug into your PC is going to be a lot more responsive and then we're also going to run now timer set resolution in the background and hop into Fortnite. And yeah guys once you're now in Fortnite you should definitely feel a difference in terms of like responsiveness you know how uh, smooth better set your Fortnite is now going to be here on controller. Of course for me I'm not a controller player so yeah I can't really give you like here the best free building but you guys get the whole point yeah it's definitely going to feel a lot smoother and I can only say like each action which I want to do is super fast now when it comes down to bottoming out. And of course also have timer set resolution running in the background. So therefore make sure to also launch that program while actually trying to play Fortnite. And with that said guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace.